Hi guys! So, I know if you didn't watch my last video that it might be a little bit of a shock. My teeth are obviously unbracist. Yeah, so it's great. I really am happy about it. And another change is my room and where I'm filming and everything's kind of different in this video. So I'm really sorry about that. Um, it might be a little sudden, but um, I moved a lot of stuff around because I actually got a new TV stand, which you guys will see in my room tour that I will be recording as soon as I paint my room, which will be within the month. So yeah. Okay, so the first thing that's really important that everyone obviously is going to mention is... um. A moisturizer and not just for your face but for your body as well because both are really important to keep healthy so my favorite two moisturizers this is my face moisturizer I use it twice every day sometimes more depends how dry my skin is especially when I'm swimming my skin gets really really dry it's kind of an awful situation but what can you do this is the Clinique dramatically different moisturizing lotion and if you have like really really oily skin you can get this in a um, in a gel form which isn't as moisturizing but it still moisturizes enough even for people that have oily skin but it won't make you break out this doesn't make me break out but I actually have really really dry skin so yeah friend of fact okay the next thing um, for your body my favorite moisturizer for your body is the coconut body butter from the body shop and um, really honestly to me nothing compares to these these are such a quality products and not only that they are really 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 amazing smelling so oh I love it they just look like that and it comes with a lot of product and actually I don't know if I'm still doing this in Canada but I saw this in the States when I was last there um they're selling ones that are double the size for only five dollars more for a limited time so it's like huge it's ridiculous so if you really really like these I really recommend checking out their website and seeing if you can order them online and if you can't head into your body shop because it's worth it I use hairspray on a daily basis only because my hair is curly and if I don't then it gets kind of just frizzy and it, I know it is frizzy but I don't know it's better when it's got hairspray in it I guess so um yeah this is the hairspray I've been loving for right now I love the Dove hairsprays they're really good quality I actually have tried like pretty much all of them this is the extra hold um hairspray with natural movement and has like a conditioner in it as well so it like kind of is going to like condition your hair I guess um this is really good for if you're going to like curl your hair and you want them to really just stay especially if you have like super straight hair this is really good except um I broke the lid or someone did I actually didn't do that so I found it this morning I was like who broke the lid yeah um but I really really like this because uh it does hold what I like to do since I want my hair to still be like naturally curly is what I do is I, I spray it and then I kind of pull it down and comb through like that and then I'll do it on this side and then I'll do it along my bangs kind of thing and I use this every day um no matter what because I want my hair to be less frizzy than it already is and my hair is really frizzy so yeah this is really cool this is actually like a a lip buffer I really like this instead of getting like um two things say you're really on a tight budget or you just don't know how you feel about those sugar scrubs I have sugar scrubs I have the lush sugar scrub it's right there I'm looking at it and um, after that you're supposed to put a lip balm on maybe you don't think that's very practical for you you have like fast-paced lifestyle this is like the perfect quick fix for that this is the menthol lip buffer from CO Bigelow you can get this at Bath and Body Works it's only seven dollars and fifty cents and um, it basically has sugar crystals inside of it. And so like when you use it, it's exfoliating, but then the actual like lip balm kind of chapstick um, lip gloss part is um, gonna condition the lips so it doesn't feel dry or cracked or anything like that. And it's awesome, it really works. Um, okay, so this is something that I use all year round and I just recently bought this one. If you saw my last, last video is a haul from Seattle and um this was mentioned i hadn't used it since then but i did use it um throughout this week so far and i am in love with the clinique powders this is the um um blended face powder and it works so well i cannot tell you how much i love this um for some reason whenever i wear foundation my skin gets a little like 
oily, like kind of weird. I don't know why. But um, this does not make my skin oily. It helps to reduce the oil. I don't even have to use mattifying powder from MAC. I like I experimented. This works so well. Um, I just use a kabuki brush with it because um, the little brush it came with is kind of impractical. It's really small and not really worth using unless you're traveling, then it'd be good. But this is what I have been loving. It's great for winter. I know a lot of people get dry skin, but some people also have oily skin. So throughout the winter, this is a great powder to try. Okay, the last product, and I actually don't have with me um, because I looked at my aunt's house, but it is the um, seven day scrub from Clinique and it's an awesome, awesome, awesome scrub. I really highly recommend it. Um, I stopped exfoliating after I used the St. Ives Apricot Scrub because it made me break out in places I'd never broken out before and I realized, oh my gosh, it's the scrub, not anything else. So it really sucked. So I broke out right here and um, I'd never broken out there. So I was kind of hesitant to start exfoliating again, but it's so worth it. Um, throughout the winter, my skin gets a little flaky, especially around my cheeks and around my chin. Um, and moisturizer wasn't really cutting it, like even the, the thick, thick, thick moisturizer. So I decided, okay, well, I'm just going to take, you know, exfoliator. So I went to the clinic counter and she gave me, well, I bought it. And um, I love it. It's an awesome scrub. I use it all over my face. I kind of avoid my nose because I know that's a super sensitive area for me. I just use it on my cheeks around here and then up in my forehead. And I haven't broken out from it really. I just my regular skin. My skin has been really clear since I started using it, so I don't know if that's just the the scrub or if that I'm just not doing something that I usually do or something. I don't know. But my skin has been really good, so it makes me really happy, and I'm really happy with my skin. Like, there's it's not dry as much anymore, and I really like it. And it's a seven-day scrub because it's gentle enough that you can use it any day. So, yeah. That is my favorites for the winter time, my things that I really recommend to try. I hope you guys enjoy this video and I will see you all later. Bye!